to make a desk like circuit on a breadboard. You need a LED, a breadboard, wires, three input dip switch. power supply and a 1k resistor and a 11k resistor now I'm going to show you how to make this desk light on a breadboard when you touch the button once it's light the second time it's just medium the third time it's very high so here when you on the first switch, it's light. The second switch, medium. The third switch, um, bright. So now I'm going to draw you the circuit. Now I'm going to show you the circuit, a drawing of the circuit. The plus sign just goes straight to the LED. The LED is this, and then it just goes straight to the plus sign of the LED. The minus sign goes straight. If you on switch one, it just goes straight to the 11K. It is a star and just goes down. Those are the stuff. And then the minus side goes straight. It, the, if you on switch two, it just goes straight up, goes through this line here, and then goes straight through the 1k resistor and just goes to the LED. If you on switch three, it just goes straight, this side, this side, straight, this side, straight, and then just goes directly to the minus side. Now, I'm going to show you on how to do it on the breadboard. At the end, 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 you're going to only use that part. You put in the three pin dip switch at the end. And then at the bottom of the dip switch, you connect number one and number two with a, a small wire. In line with number one, line number two are connected there. And you connect number two and number three over there. One and number two, number three and number four, I meant number one and number two, number two and number three. And use a gray wire and connect, put a gray wire here. Put a gray wire from switch three outwards. Switch three outwards. You can move it up if you want to. And then move it up. Switch three outwards. And use a one um one K resistor and put it in the same line. Number five goes down. The gray one is there. I put the resistor here and then connect it to in line with switch 2 and then take the 11k resistor 11k resistor and put it in the same line but here here in line 1 and then in the same line number 5 number 5 same line from number 1 there number 2 there and number 3 there just number 1 these two are resistors. And now the LED. You put the LED, the minus side here. You check like this. The longer side is the plus side. The longer side is the plus side. The shorter side is the minus side. You put the minus side in line with five. Number five. You put it there where everything was. And then put the plus on the other side like this and leave a light a uh, hole open there by the plus and use a wire and connect the plus to the other side of the breadboard use another wire and connect the plus to the other side of the breadboard like 
that and it, it's done that's it let's try it now you take the minus and put it here because i put the minus here the minus there put the plus there In line with the yellow, in line with the plus, put the plus here. In line with the minus, put the minus right here. In the first one, you put the minus. Let's test it. The wire is weak. So I'm going to put in a proper wire. You need to put the wire in properly. And try. Deep and properly. And on number one, it's very light. Number two. Number one is light, number two is bright, and number three is very bright. That's it. Number one, number two. Number one, number two. Just to be brighter. Number three. That's it. Works. Same like this. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three.